I guess you're. if you go to the board, you're just going to get a blister and kill somebody. Probably. And then suddenly the market is flooded with them and there's a million people selling them. And But if you're dealing with like a, you know, a, a player that really wants or needs a card that you're, you know, that they've picked out of your trade binder. Mike's wearing cologne. Am I? Something. And so if he plays Heliod on three and, and wants to combo off the next. Hey, how we doing? This is Andy with another episode of Attacking the Meta. This is episode number nine. Yes, I do know what episode we're on because I looked it up. Um, anyway, essentially, I'm actually uploading this, I don't know, whatever day the Band and Restricted announcement came out. 13th, I think? Something like that. Uh, anyway, I'm, I'm doing it really early, or uh, literally a week early, because I'm going to be on a canoeing trip, and I'm going to miss next Monday, so... Getting this out for you ahead of time. Hopefully, I'll be able to have be able, be able words, words. Hopefully, I'll be able to put another one out for the week after as well. But we'll see. The time is definitely running thin. Um, anyway, let's get on the show. This is what I'm running what I call uh, the No Zone, and this is essentially just a crazy control deck. Um, we have three win cons in this deck. I, I like to consider uh, one is Dream Trawler. Actually, is a win con. Two is the emergency powers Narset combo. Essentially, it means it tries to make us both draw seven cards, like shuffle our hand away and draw seven cards. It's a wheel effect. And then with Narset, it says if I do it on my turn, they only draw one card. If I do it on their turn, they draw no cards. Um, doesn't literally win the game, but it puts us far enough ahead where they, they will probably scoop. And the other way we can win is just sheer boredom. That's what we're going for. That is the best way to win. Uh, so essentially, card draw, we have Revitalize and Frantic Inventory. Frantic Inventory is insane. Uh, as we get further into the game, they get crazy. Revitalize is really good, just to gain some life. We need that. Uh, counter Magic, we have Dovin's Veto and Absorb. Seven total counter spells. Main deck is pretty good. We have, for Planeswalkers, Narset and Teferi. And then, of course, Dream Trawler for the only other permanent in the deck. Uh, board wipes. We have four shatters, four planner cleansings. Really, when we talk about the meta right now, you have some aggressive decks, and then you have Team of Reclamation, you have Simic Flash, and then you have Simic Splash, another card, uh, Gross Spiral, Uro, Nissa, Ugin decks. And planner cleansing is really good against most of those decks. It's not quite fast enough against the, the aggro decks, but. Kills Team of Reclamation, kills all the Planeswalkers, kills all the creatures. Um, doesn't hit Nissa's creatures, which is a little annoying, but it's the, the price to pay. Um, it's good. Discontinue, uh, discontinuity. I can never say this card right. This is just a way to kind of end the turn. Um, it's essentially just a counterspell, but sometimes you just blank a uh, Planeswalker's ultimate. Like, they go... I'm going to ult uh, 4 mana Teferi to take 2 extra turns. You're like, nope, this turn's over and you're not going to get those other turns either. Especially if you have your own Teferi out, it's really strong. Um, sometimes against Simic Flash, they'll be like, end of turn, I'm going to cast this wolf. And I'll be like, no, actually I'll end my turn. And you're like, well, no wolf for you. And it's really cheap when you do that. And then we already talked about Dream Trawler and Emergency Powers. Playing 2 Castle Arden Vale, 1 Castle Vantress. One Mystic Sanctuary as our kind of interesting lands. Everything else pretty pretty standard blue white. Four shocks, four scries. Simple stuff, man. Um, anyway, if you're new to this series, essentially what we do is we we take a deck and we try not to use meta decks. We try to go off meta, but can compete in the meta because they fight on a certain angle. They're always going to be worse than like your best deck in the format. All the all those meta decks. But they tend to be more fun, and we run them through a gauntlet of five best of one ranked matches, and we see where we end up. Um, obviously, we're going for the 5-0, but we'll do the best we can, and, and, we'll, and we'll go from there. It's it's about just kind of testing these decks out, see if they're somewhat viable, and having a good time. So this hand's pretty good. We did actually put, I don't remember what, Dovin's Vito on the bottom. Um, so this looks like a Simic type deck. We'll shock so we can revitalize. <coughs> we'll see if he, he plays a third color or if this is Simic Flash. 
really like if there's no third color, it's always flash. Okay, so this red, so it's team of reclamation. Um, pretty pretty easy to kind of figure out this stuff. Um, so yeah, we'll just play the basic islands. Gives us access to frantic, and then we have two absorbs as well. Mostly we want the absorb for next turn when he tries to play the reclamation. We don't really care about it right here. Worst thing he can play for us is Uro, and we're not going to counter it anyway. Comes in tapped. We'll draw a card. Oop. It's really nice when you start seeing them in groups. Playing the shock land because we just want to keep up uh, absorb mana anyway. Mm, there's no advantage to having four mana over three. Technically, I guess if they play nothing, we'd play frantic inventory into like a revitalize. We wouldn't play the second frantic inventory if if they played played the first one because we just don't need too many cards in our hand. Dobin's Vetoes now is actually really nice. We'll play the Arden Veil. I will pass turn. So this is nice because now we have Absorb and Veto that we can both play. So if he tries to like play a sneaky uh, Mystical Dispute or something. If he does nothing, this just leads into our favor for sure. Uh, I should have made a 1-1 one -one there. Oh well. Uh, let's put Frantic Inventory on top. I actually thought that was the castle. Oh well. So we missed a 1-1. One -one. Let's see what other misplays we can make today. Yep, we just grab. That's fine. I realized it was that I would have put played island that way I could put a uh, counter spell on top. I could have. <laughs> That's such a such an expensive stifle. Love it though. Wilderness wreck. We'll actually use absorb here. That way, if he has some sort of counter magic, we get it out of his hand. In case he has two of them, though, what we're going to do is we're going to Dovin's Veto the Wilderness Reclamation. We could have just paid for a single Mystical Dispute, but where he had two mana up, if he just plays the other Mystical Dispute, we're, we're bone, no matter how else we play it. We don't gain three life, but that's alright. We're able to take a Counterspell out of his hand by playing it that way. Now we get to Frantic again. Now, does he want an explosion? It's the end of your turn. You'd be doing it for four. Nope, okay. Now I'm going to play Teferi. If he doesn't counter it, then I have Absorb. Which means I can counter anything he wants to do. I'm going to tick up, because... That's what we do with Teferi's. Which... Now, with that sticking, next turn I can play Narset and eventually set up a Emergency Powers. Which will close out the game, most likely. I don't know what you're thinking about. You can't do anything right now. Uh, Sharks, Typhoon, I guess. Or Scry. Yeah, you guys can try. This is actually nice, because it's, it's a way to counter Shark Typhoon. It would, would have been a little sketch to play it there, because I want to keep up Absorb. For his, like, Wilderness Rock, if he has it. Not that... Bullet Strike is too important when I have to ferry out. Nice. So now we'll play this. You're going to let it resolve because I have to ferry. Activate. 
I'm gonna take this. Because I don't want to take the emergency powers and let them see that I have that. Although I'm really not planning on casting Frantic Inventory either. Another land would have been nice. So I, if he plays like Typhoon here, I could discontinue. Like, I actually have to do this because a 6 6 is just really too annoying. But it means now, if he wants to play Reclamation, I can't actually play Absorb. I could play Planner Cleansing anytime I want, I guess. But I mean, Reclamation doesn't do a ton when I have to ferry out, I guess. Now I actually will play inventory end of his turn, just to play the land. Help you out. Feet Jonathan Robbins by Lionel Tassio. Planes will be the land. <laughs> um, minus two. Should have done this after, actually. Oh well. Plus one. I want to do it on his upkeep. Or I want to do it on his draw step, actually. So I do it on his draw step. He draws a card, then I get him to get rid of everything. He can't respond to it. The only thing he can do is either put something on Blast Zone, uh, Scry with Castle Vantress, or... Um, make a token with what you might call it, the Shark Typhoon. Yeah, you want to block it? That's fine. Bad love by Noel. Very plus. Discard the lands. Pass a draw. Emergency powers. I'm just good by Jimmy Resolve. Grimes. And like, if he does anything, I can just play this. Well, I don't actually have any of these cards, but I probably can play something else. Last night by Lionel Cassio. <sighs> Excuse me. Call Even me this can't kill to ferry right now, which is nice. And we can get away with the deal with it, but we do have another Narset on the lock. On the ready. Yeah, but like I said, most of the time it just makes him scoop. Uh, so we'll take game number one. Against Team of Wreck. Uh, definitely a good uh, good first one to show off. I'll open that pack at the end for you guys. Yeah, I mean Team of Wreck's the best, best, uh, best deck in the format right now, so... Being able to beat that is definitely nice. This isn't the greatest. I don't want to see these Narsets, but we'll keep it anyway. Because we at least have Teferi in hand and a Revitalize and a Frantic. Um, okay. Mono Green, it looks like. I'll actually keep that. Um, awkwardness is I. this comes in tapped right now. Even after this. But let's let's scry. I'd rather scry. Let's put that on bottom. So worst case, I can put this in tapped if I need to to revitalize. By fireflies. We need to find a shatter. Could also play like a Narset. 
and then have to draw a land as well. I think this goes in tapped, we revitalize, gain some life, because then it allows us to actually have four mana next turn. So if we draw it, we actually can cast it. I think this uh, this matchup surely comes down to hitting a uh, a board wipe or not. Especially this guy is like going all in on this. Fantasy by Declan DP. Well, let's see if I can hit it. There it is. Boom. Now he still has four cards. Like the game's not over, but I definitely, uh, definitely took the lead there. I'm only at six. Of course, I can go to nine. If he plays a single creature, I can to ferry to put it back in his hand. Maybe it's a little annoying. Feather by Luckily, like it doesn't do anything, I guess. Um, let's play to ferry. I don't know if I want a plus or minus. I think we want a plus, because we can still draw a card. We're not, like, needing cards right now. If he, as long as he doesn't have anything with haste. Like a questing beast. Gem Razor's fine. That means, because this also means we get to uh, bounce it. Gain some more Atlantis life. By Scandinavians. Bounce. Let's see what I hit off of this. Good morning by Amin Maxwell. Um inventory, what do I want here? What's what is his ultimate or her ultimate? Hmm. We're already there. Dream by by Brave so this doesn't help. We already have a shadow. Let's go with card draw, I guess. Let's go that way. Tropical Traveler by Dell. Six mana. This is this is actually kind of scary. What does he get? Ceratops, oh yeah, and that has haste as well. It cannot be bounced. I do have Shatter. Where is it coming? It coming at me? I would assume so. Come on, Narset, okay. Well, I'm okay with that. That means me five life. Other things. Now I can tick up. Okay, one, two, three, four. This land can go untapped. Keddy by Lockspeeds. Bottom. So now we have instant speed shatter, and we also can play revitalize or frantic inventory. Lahar. Especially if he tries to like mutate here. Or if he plays that. That's fine, that don't matter either. I like him playing all this stuff pre-combat. No prayers by Pokey DJ. This isn't a flash or anything now. Yep. Super happy the Shatter hits an extra permanent here. Really hoping he doesn't have heroic intervention. Nope, you don't. Cool. Coming home by Liquid and Daybox. Nissa, who shakes the world. Ooh, let's inventory. Kind of hoping to hit a planner cleansing here. Of course, now if he taps, makes a land, I'll, I'll bounce the land. Man, if I hit shatter, bounce the land and shatter, or cleansing. I feel really good. 
Well, that's pretty good anyway. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'll play the Arden Veil, that way I can revitalize as well. First class by Payrouse. Scott Buckley. Uh, yep. The revitalize gains me a little bit more life as well, which is nice. Artifact or enchantment, sure. Nice things I can play to fairy and bounce it all. Oh, this is still bugged. That sucks. That's supposed to be a 6-6. Six, six. Or 7-7, seven, seven, actually. Yeah, that's bugged. That's too bad. That, that absolutely should be a 7-7. Seven, seven. What's a 5-5? Five, five? Take 5. Three. Uh, one, two, three. Let's revitalize again. Do this. Four mana available. I'll grab planner cleansing, sure. Six to his face. Gain six, so actually a block. Cool. I'm fine with that as well. Because now, I don't plan on cleansing, I emergency powers. You get a 3-3. Three, three. Gonna kill Narset? Kill Narset, I plan on cleansing. It's big now. Sure. Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have plenty of mana to play this. Bounce here. I know it seems weird. I just don't want to get blown up by heroic intervention. Though I do know I do lose my Teferi. That's not to say playing the other order wouldn't have been better. It, it very well may have been, but the order I played it in was definitely safer. Well, yeah, all those lands are different for the most part. Yeah, you can have that. That don't bother me. You want to empty your, your hand? So I get another cleansing. Actually, now we now we'll just shatter. We'll give him another card, right? Do we? Now we don't need to give him a card. Should have played land first, because then it wouldn't have tapped that. Um. Yep. I'm gonna keep absorb up. Nope. I'm back to 19. That was an absorb, sure. Should 
played this on this draw step. Actually, will emergency powers, and I have absorbed back. Oh, actually, I don't have absorbed back. Yes, I do. Nice. There we go. Again, as usual, enough to get him to scoop. And I have. I had fun that match. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Oh, that's so, so bad. I don't think he said yes. Well, uh, let's go to game number three. Currently 2-0. -oh. A couple revitalized, so that's pretty good. I already have this combo, but it's way too early. Show me land. So this is probably Reclamation. But it could be some sort of... Um, is it spells kind of... Yeah, there it is. So it's an is it spells variant. I'll take one. Swing. You won't. Oh, he did. Hey, cool. I don't have to shock myself. Now, I have Veto, if needed, but it shouldn't be needed. We'll just revitalize. We'll be able to keep ahead of this guy for a little bit. See what he tries to cast. I mean, if he casts, like, like, a Chandra, I guess I counter that. Real form. I don't think I want him to have that either, actually. Maybe for two. If I can clear the board, Narset will be pretty strong, I think. Tapped. I already have my little land, which is nice. Four mana. This is where this could start hurting. Revitalize and will gain me a lot of the life back, though. Yeah. Yeah, so Narset would have been nice this turn. He's leaving, like, negate mana open. I'm not sure if he has negate, but just, like, leaving two mana open. Revitalize. Let's play this. Pass turn. Ideally, we play Revitalize twice, but we may need to absorb something. We'll see. Yeah, that's fine. Revitalize. Game three to the four back. It's gonna be demoralizing for him. Negate. Yeah, sure. That's kind of what we wanted to see. Revitalize. If you gave the first one, what are you doing about the second one? We need to ferry. He has to counter that, which means I'm safe to shatter next turn, most likely. Yep, yeah, cool. I'm just gonna hope that the shatter resolves next turn. He only has one card in hand, so it, the chance of it being a counterspell is not massive. Well, we got another try if it doesn't. No, we don't have another try if it doesn't, because this is a counter magic, we just die. And we did die. 
shoot, man. We got spells. We did. Alright, we're up 2 1. Took our first loss. Is it spells? Get three negates in his opener. That's brutal. Or it's not, maybe not his opener, but three negates right off the bat anyway. <sighs> I guess she's kind of unlucky. Oh, this is interesting. We don't want to play this early, but we can if we need to. We do have double revitalize. We do have shatter, which is nice. Let's see what our opponent's playing. We, in fact, will just play Hollow Fountain Taps. You know, play is nice. We get green land. Potentially mono green again. Um, could be something else. Excuse? Preserver, okay. We'll gain life. We want to hit a different land? Yes, we did. Cool. Now, if he's on flash, he no longer has flash access. If he's on mono green, we're still in an okay position. I do. Not a lot. Um, he's a 2 2, huh? Let's revitalize. This is some, like, weird mono green variant. Okay, we can play this one now. Teferi dies. Oh. Teferi dies a lot. I take seven into Teferi dies. The nice thing is we do still have Shatter. I don't think I need to put Shatter on top quite yet. Play this in tap instead. We have Dream Trawler available now. Also, have Narset into Absorb available. Of course, he's gonna play creatures this turn. Of course, Revitalize did gain us enough life, so, like, that wasn't anywhere near as bad as it could have been. Actually, I think he might have swung a little bit. Yeah, no, that's. Yeah, he must have swung the 2 2 or the 3 3, actually. At, um. Fairy. Whoops. No, I cast two Revitalize. Okay, so that's right. Play your Preserver? To put one counter on Pelt Collector, where you could have played Preserver into Pelt Collector. You put two counters on Pelt Collector? Not Pelt Collector, on uh, Preserver. Gem Razor. Oh, man. He's a big boy. Let's see what I hit off this. Grab and absorb. Let's put uh, shatter on top. The great hand is no. kind of happy with that. We still are at 20. And here's the nice part where we can shatter with absorb backup. Of course he does draw the card, but still. No, we're not ending the turn. I just end the turn myself. Six mana. We'll just even play something huge here. We counter it and we untap and play Dream Trawler. Questing Beast. Absorb. That's big enough. I 
Art of Elf is on bottom. Play a Trawler. This thing actually can, does have reach. And if he plays a creature, he actually can uh, get it big enough to block, which is kind of annoying. Well, I won't get big enough. Not yet, anyway. Yeah, it does, actually. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, he's swinging! He's swinging! Nice! Nice! That we don't want to cast yet. We can cast it later if we need to, but we kind of like this race. Would be a sick play by him and swing. Four damage, flash another one of these, and then try to pump it really big. But I can just like counter it and end the attack, which would be even sweeter. Land, he has two cards left. Definitely I'll draw him. Gem Razor, he says. Sure. Luckily, look, like, hopefully he goes to swing both. Let's see what he does. Yeah, we'll just end that. So I don't want to take 14. I am drawing more cards a turn than he is. Can I swing now? Please? what's on top. I am afraid I will have to planner cleansing eventually. That's not what we want on top. I can take 14 once. And if he doesn't attack, I can actually swing into him and just gain life. And draw the cards anyway. Oh god, yeah, we need to counter that. Because that pumps the preserver massively. Uh, this is actually fine. We'll take 14. Because it doesn't. it's not even a two turn clock. Let's scry first. We don't want that. Because we already have that. This is kind of nice as well. Oh, crap. Well, it's alright. We'll see. Make sure he doesn't draw anything crazy. If I didn't play the land, of course, I did want to play the land because the scrying was important. Would have drawn this anyway. But this does block him all day. Doesn't block him. Hopefully, we don't just die here. 14. You'd have to pump this by 7. Which means he'd have to play a 2 drop or a 1 drop. That's a 2 drop. Oh shit, I think we just died. Shoot a cleansing last turn. It's 22. Shit. Ah, we're 2-2. Two, two. Man, I thought we had this get game one. We misplayed. Though I think I just died of the, that anyway. 
Uh, I mean, he did have to top deck it. Oh well. Happens. Anyway, we'll go into the game number five. So far, they've been good games at least. No complaints there. And if we win game five, we still go positive. That's fine. That was a hard loss to take, though. We should just plan our cleansings. Oh well. Yeah, I don't like the sanctuary here, but otherwise it looks pretty good. We do have the inventory. We can cast on two. We'll keep it. It's not amazing, but we'll keep it. And the, uh, this helps out as well. The Skyland. Oh, okay. Now I kind of like this. Oh, uh, sure, we'll keep that. Because turn three Teferi bounce Fox is, is pretty strong. And then if we can play Teferi on an empty board eventually, it's really strong. Now, we'll have to keep up counter magic. Ooh, we can get rid of the stinger. It's going all in on this. I don't want to take any more damage than I need to off my lands. But if we can play Narset on an empty board, then we just win. Because he can no longer cycle. Oh, god damn it. I didn't want him to play that. I want him to keep cycling. Yeah, that's fine. I'll draw a card. Castle Arden Vale being our next. Bounce the Fox. back. This deck's super explosive. I, you don't see this too much anymore because it just dies to all the Euro decks. Ah, board wipe would be huge if we find one. Yeah, kill to fairy. I mean, come on. Come on, show me board wipe. Not a board wipe. Go to Fairy and look for one. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm dead on board, so yeah, I actually have to play this way. We'll scry first. This can potentially do most damage. There it is. We'll still need to avoid the uh, Zenith Flare. Look at him, just play that out. Ooh. We've got to avoid the flare. That's the scary thing. Watch him have a cycler in his hand, so he just, like, miss lethal. Well, let's shatter. He did have a cycler, so he did have lethal. And I was tapped out. So I died of Zenith Flare, and I died to um, him just like playing a Drain of Stinger and, and cycling. There's Zenith Flare. Oh, fucking course. Oh, well. I mean, that game was pretty much a blowout, I'll give him that. But the other, other two losses were really close. Definitely a misplay on that. I told you I'd, I'd open a pack for you, and I'll do that. I'm a good guy. Good guy, Andy. But other than that, I uh, appreciate you guys watching. Appreciate uh, sticking around. Please hit that like button. Please hit the subscribe button. If you have any suggestions of any decks you want to see me run, put them in the comments or PM me. Um... Whether it's just a general concept or if it's a specific deck list. Note, I will change your deck list, but feel free. With that, um, check out the uh, podcast every Thursday. 
everywhere that your podcasts can be found, as well as, of course, right here on YouTube. And other than that, I'm just extra content. See ya.